Hello friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. In today's video, we're gonna be planning out my week from the 23rd of Jan through the 29th of Jan. I realized that I never really do a proper intro to my videos, just letting you guys know who I am and what I do. I'm Shen, I live in London, uh, I live at home with my parents and I'm a project manager or a management consultant at a financial services company. Uh, on this channel, I like to do kind of planning videos, budget and finance videos, and then the occasional vlog and lifestyle video as well. So if you are interested in knowing what we're doing this week, just keep on watching. Okay, so uh, I am filming this on Tuesday in typical me fashion. Uh, I did get back from my boyfriend's house quite late on Sunday, so there was no way I was filming this because I like to film in natural light. I've also just realised that I had a little sticker here yesterday and it seems to have gone walkies. So I'm just going to put another one there because I think it looks cute. It's just my little laptop sticker. But yeah, I'm filming this on Tuesday instead. I have like a little like 30 minute between a morning of back to back. So I thought I'd just get this video filmed for you. But yesterday was quite a busy day. I was in the office. I got to the office for about 11 o'clock quite lucky that my um team are very flexible when i do go into the office which is very very rarely like this is the second time in the year that i've gone in i make it very clear that i prefer to go later on in the day i don't like to go early in the morning because i don't like the rush of the mornings and you got to pay more for the train so i went in for around 11 11 30 and i left just before six i was gossiping with a colleague um and one of my meetings ran over so I, my plan was to go to the gym and do a zumba workout or a zumba class at six but that didn't happen so ended up just doing just under an hour workout at the gym followed the 12 3 30 but i kind of changed it up and i did like 14 3.5 30 so yeah i just needed something that was sort of calorific so i'd burn a couple of calories but i didn't really have to think because it had been a very long day of me using my brain quite a lot so that 12 3 30 is quite helpful um i booked some beauty treatments that i've got this week that we'll see later on i made a boots order because they had 20 percent off um i'm doing some market research actually with youtube which is quite exciting uh, as i'm in the partner program they did contact me to see if i wanted to do some market research with them which is very cool and they pay me 100 pounds so that's great um did all my usual stuff uh i did edit uh last week's plan with me or the week before actually filled out my trackers uploaded some receipts for some of these sort of apps that i'm part of exported my video and planned the rest of the week I had ramen for dinner didn't spend any money because my lunch at work is subsidized and then we burnt 1000 1007 calories so yeah good day overall it's kind of like a whistle stop tour of my day on to Tuesday, which is today. So I want to go to Zumba today at six. I'm really like upping the amp with my workout, seeing as I'm going to Dubai in like just over a month. So yeah, I do want to go back to Zumba kind of two to three times a week. And then the rest of the days uh, that I'm actually at home and not like at my boyfriend's house, I want to just do like a regular gym workout. I might try some other classes at the gym, but I'm just kind of comfortable doing what I'm doing for now. I'm also wanting to get back into doing two workouts a day, which is what I did for a while during the pandemic because it was kind of like all I could do. Um, and this morning I did actually do a workout and I'm just going to check what the workout was. I've got my Apple Watch here. So... I did a quick like kind of arm workout in the morning. It was like a stand up, stand up one. It was with Grow With Joe. Absolutely love her. I think she's great. Her videos are so, so helpful and they're quite quick. So I did do one of her workouts, which was like, I think 21 minutes. And then I did like a stretch. And then I think I forgot to turn my watch off for a couple of minutes. So in total, it ended up being 28 minutes and I burnt 149 calories. So yeah, I'll have another one uh, at six this evening. So that should be good. My goal when I am doing like a more active day and working out is to hit at least a thousand calories. That's kind of the goal to burn. Uh, I am also wanting, and I've actually already done all of these to-dos. It's only 10.32 and I've done quite a lot today. I'm wanting to wake up a little bit earlier 
so today I woke up at 7.45, didn't actually get out of bed until about five past eight, but you know what? It's the intention, isn't it? So I wanted to do my thumbnail for the video that I exported yesterday. I wanted to upload and schedule, did that as well. So that's a plan with me that's ready to go. I also wanted to film this plan with me, which I am going to tick off because I have obviously now done it, what I'm doing it did my am routine already i have taken my vitamins and i have already worked out because i've done that morning one so we're knocking off quite a few already which is fabulous i need to do my market research task for uh the youtube study that i'm part of so i think it's like you've got to answer like a couple of questions a day for seven days um so i think i'm on like today will be day five so i need to make sure i do that you do get sent a notification but i want to make sure i know to tick it off because it does need to be done within the day i want to organize my goals because what i did do is and i've been having this as a reoccurring to do i wanted to make kind of like a video of my goals for this year and i've written them all out but i just want to like manage how i'm going to lay it out in my planner make sure that the goals still align with exactly what i want to do just so that i can actually film my goals video tomorrow fingers crossed i keep saying i want to film it but i really want to actually get that filmed so that i can get that for you guys before the end of january and then i do have a appointment with my esthetician today just for like a face wax so i want to write that down i usually get it done just before my facial my facial is tomorrow so i definitely want to get that and that is at i definitely wrote a c instead of an x so we're going to try and make that an x <laughs> uh, and that is at 8 30 p.m oh i thought it was 8 p.m what a hot mess but anyway um that is pretty much that i do have my youtube video live today but um i can't find my youtube stickers so yeah and that is actually going live at six but i'm just gonna pop it down here just because we've got other things going on there so i'm just gonna put live and that is my 9th through the 15th of jan plan with me you'll probably notice that i've just been uploading plan with me for the last couple of weeks and that is literally because um it's just been a bit manic to be completely honest with you i mentioned in the last plan with me that my boyfriend had surgery he ended up being a lot more immobile than i think we both thought i ended up having to actually take a day off of work and i stayed at his for a day longer than i was supposed to he's doing a lot better now thankfully um but that kind of like derailed everything and there was a day that i was meant to come back on a saturday so that i had sunday to film and just organize myself didn't end up doing that so yeah we're kind of just behind i didn't actually film a plan with me for last week but pretty much i was just working all week and then uh went to my boyfriend's house on friday came back on sunday so nothing really crazy happened and i didn't have a chance to film so i just figured that i wouldn't bother <laughs> um because it wasn't very eventful anyway but yeah that is today i don't think we've got anything else to do on to wednesday um wednesday is actually my friend ria's birthday so I want to pop a little present down just so that I can remember to send her a message. And it's getting to the point now where a lot of my friends are turning 26. I'm turning 26 this year as well. So yeah, that is exciting. She's one of the first to turn 26. So I love that. Um, I do want to edit this plan with me that I am filming now just so that I've got something edited. I want to film my goals video and I'm gonna hopefully film that. I'm not gonna put myself to too much pressure on myself but I do want to. I want to upload and schedule that plan with me so hopefully I can actually, or this plan with me, so that I can have that ready to go in case I don't actually have time to film the goals video. So I've got some content for you guys. I want to have at least one video up a week. Ideally, it'll be two to three, but I'm not going to put too much pressure on myself. And there are weeks that I'm very busy. So at least one a week, I think, is manageable. And then I've just got my facial at 8pm. So I can pop that down. I definitely need it. I don't know what's been going on with my skin recently. For the most part, like, I have quite good skin i don't really get blemishes it's very very rare but recently i've been getting a lot more blemishes and i don't really know what's going on i know that like your skin changes with hormones and things like that i mean i am during my period next week so it could be that 
but yeah i've got like two or three blemishes and i'm kind of freaking out so i did actually order some la roche posay like specific blemish stuff uh that should be coming in the next couple of days so hopefully i can start using that because it's literally just my forehead there's like two or three blemishes on my forehead and that's kind of it the scarring doesn't really stay like i don't really get crazy scarring and after like a month or two like there's no remnants of the spot but it's still just like i don't know i'm just <laughs> you know what it's like as a woman as soon as you get one spot you just freak out so yeah i definitely want to get my monthly facial i think that should help with the blemishes um i guess i also want to do my thumbnail for this plan with me just so that like the video is fully ready to go and that's pretty much wednesday on to thursday now so i need to plan out my pay because we do actually get um our pay slips the day before we get paid so i get paid on friday this month so i'll know exactly how much i'm getting on my paycheck on thursday so i can actually figure out how much cash i want to take out things like that my goal is to edit my goals video this day so yeah we'll see <laughs> like i said i'm not gonna put too much pressure on myself i know i need to get it done but yeah, I also want to film my budget recap this day because obviously it's the last day that I'll be using the budget for January. And I don't really have, I'm not planning on spending any money on Thursday, so I should be able to film that quite early on in the day. Um, and then that's kind of it for Thursday. I'm not really doing anything else. I will obviously be going to the gym after work. My goal is to actually go to the gym seven times this week um i did go yesterday uh today like i said i've got zumba wednesday thursday and friday i'm just gonna do like a normal gym workout saturday zumba and then sunday a normal gym workout although i've been seeing all the girls doing pilates recently and that's something that i kind of want to do my gym does do a pilates class but it's like early on in the day when i'd be at work so i'm not sure i'm gonna do it at the gym i might try and see if i can just watch like a youtube video and do it last time i did pilates my wrists were really sore because i've got like quite tiny like weak wrists so hopefully i can kind of build up some wrist strength but let me know if you guys have ever dabbled into pilates it's definitely something i want to um get into right on to friday now i finally got my shit together and actually found my payday stickers i had another of like set lying around so i want to pop that down friday is finally payday i know some people say that january feels like a million months and i completely agree however i did kind of make it feel less like a million months because i actually instead of using my paycheck or budgeting with my paycheck when i actually got it which was like a week and a half two weeks before i normally would get my paycheck i actually just put it away and only used it and started budgeting with it when I would normally get paid so it felt like a normal month to me although it still has felt very long even though I did that so that's a little tip for you if you find that your January or your that your January budget just does not stretch and it feels like it lasts way too long so yeah payday on Friday I do want to go to the bank um uh, to get out the money i need to pay for certain things this month there are certain things that i pay for in cash so i need to make sure that i have that i want to film my budget for february and then i also kind of want to film a cash unstuffing and the reason i want to do this is i'm kind of changing things up and i don't think i'm gonna cash budget anymore and i'll explain everything in that video but i want to explain yeah why i'm going to stop cash budgeting or cash stuffing and i want to actually unstuff the cash that i've got in my binders so we can talk through that on that video if you're interested uh, it should be up kind of the first or second week of february i also want to hopefully upload and schedule that goals video fingers crossed and then also do the thumbnail for it as well and then I do have a waxing appointment at 8pm. So I'm just going to take one of these little foiled heart stickers. <sighs> Although it's not going to feel very lovely. It's crazy. I've been getting waxed for years now. And I finally feel like my hair is really thinning out. Like I typically get waxed every four weeks. And my legs honestly just, they don't even look like they need to be waxed, which is great. So it clearly is working. I need to actually just do laser at some point. But we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So that is friday i've also just slightly opened the blinds because it felt a little bit dark so sorry about that guys on to saturday so i will have zumba at 11 30 a.m 
I always like to do that because it sort of means that I am getting up at a decent time and not just sleeping in all day because I hate as much as I do love sleeping in I do always feel so unproductive because I'm like I could have done so much stuff so Zumba 11 30 a.m and to be fair like it still isn't super early I could be getting up at 10 I'd still get a line um I want to plan out next week I also want to set up next week which uh essentially means to me like getting that bit done that bit done for the whole week so that when it comes to me like wanting to film it's all good to go I also do want to actually film my plan with me I find that when I film it on Saturday it's just a lot easier and I'm not scrambling to film on Sunday instead I need to oil my hair and wash my hair and then I need to pick up some drinks because it is my friend Ria's like little birthday. She's having like a little house party slash sort of, I don't know, like little shindig at her house, which should be super fun. So yeah, I wanna actually just pick up some drinks for that. I am planning on not drinking for the month of January and February. I've just decided the February part just now, <laughs> but I'm not like, if I'm honest, I'm not a massive drinker anyway. Like I, I don't need, I'm not one of those people that needs alcohol to have fun. It's just, you know, I'll do it casually, I'll drink it casually. But I wanna be more intentional to not have a drink over the next two months because I know that when I go to Dubai, I'll probably drink, be drinking quite a lot. And, I don't need those extra calories right now. So yeah, I'm going to kind of do dry Jan and dry Feb. And uh, my friend did say like in her little birthday invite text, like everybody just bring a bottle and we can kind of just have like a really chilled night. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to let her know that I will bring like mixers and juices and things like that uh, instead of bringing a bottle of alcohol. And I think that should be fine. So yeah, I need to pick up those and then yeah, her little house party. I'm not entirely sure what time it's going to be, but I've just put it at six. This day, I also have my video live and that is going to be my January budget results. I also just realised that on Friday, I wrote upload and schedule and I'm actually referring to my budget results, not my goals video. So I'm just going to put um, budget results here so I know. Um, live budget. Is that it? Yeah. That is pretty much it for Saturday. On to Sunday, I want to change my pillowcases. You guys know this is pretty much just standard for every single Sunday. I want to hoover, do my bathroom reset, my bedroom reset. I want to deep clean my retainers, which is a new one. I try to do it every single week, but I reckon if I just do it every Sunday and have it more as a routine to do it on Sunday, that'll probably work better. I want to do a washing load and edit my February budget. And that is Sunday. So friends, there you have it. That was my plan with me from Monday the 23rd of January through Sunday the 29th of January. It's gonna be like quite a chilled week. I'm actually really excited to see my friend Ria. She's actually somebody that I went to high school with and I haven't seen her for ages. And I think she's gonna try and sort of also make it a bit of a reunion from uh, sort of people that we haven't seen in a while. So it'll be so nice to be around some friends. I must admit, I haven't really met up with many friends recently because it's just been, I don't know, it's been, it's been that kind of time. Um, I did think I'd see a lot more people in December, but with the cost of living crisis and everything just being a bit crazy and it being so cold, I just didn't really plan much. But I'm trying to be more intentional with actually meeting friends this year and making a bit more of an effort. So yeah, that will be a lovely start to that. I hope that you have had a great week when you're watching this. Let me know what you're doing this week. Have you got anything fun planned? I'm so glad that it's payday week and I'm sure you guys are too if you're getting paid sort of at the end of the month. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to like and subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.